Okay, so in the first episode we actually made a snare sound. In this episode I'm tying that snare sound to an ARP, ARP number one. And putting a snare on beat one, then missing six beats, and then putting it on the next beat, and three beats I'm missing out, then six, and then six again, then three beats, and I'm drawing a fill, a drum fill, to take a sound to pH two of the ARP. Here's what it sounds like. On the second page of the ARP, I'm putting a note on the first beat of every bar. Right click to activate that page. Left click on the play button to play them one after the other. On the third page, I'm just taking out every other beat. Right click to activate that page. And on the fourth page, I'm just leaving a sound on every beat. And here's what the whole sequence sounds like. Okay, so that's a very basic ARP pattern for a snare riser. I might tweak that a bit later on, who knows? I might take some of that reverb out, I'm not quite sure yet. But let's leave it there for the moment for part two. Part three coming up soon. See you then. <laughs>